videos. It's like a recommendation and what I got, but I, I'm not doing a haul for this, so I guess I'm gonna just show y'all what I got too. Gotta get real again. Gotta get real again. Gotta get real again. Gotta get real again. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Lala Tatiana if you're new here and I'm coming to you guys today with a Sephora recommendations video. So these are the things that I would say you should pick up if you're going to shop the Sephora VIB sale. This is like the time of year you want to stock up on like your staple items or the item that you really want something on your wish list or those really good value sets that they have. You know, some are good, some aren't. So we're gonna go down and I'm gonna say what I got or what I picked up from the sale. And then I'm gonna even give some more suggestions because I, you know, I can't get everything that I want that I would buy the whole store then. But I'm gonna go down and then I'm gonna give you guys some suggestions on things that I think you should pick up. Let me go and look up my order. I only placed one order. Now I was thinking about going and getting another order, but I don't think I should. I think I'm gonna just be content because I didn't even hit Rouge this year. This is my first time not hitting Rouge in a while um i usually always hit the guy be rouge and this year i just wasn't feeling maybe no actually last year i didn't either after the pan you know everything that happened um i just wasn't really buying makeup or even skincare and stuff like that so i didn't hit rouge this year either. so the first thing i'm going to talk about which is like one of my favorite things is like the perfume sampler sets like these come out every year i don't know if they come out like annually i think they sprinkle some in like throughout the year but they always have like a holiday one and you can get all these samples smell your um perfume that you like the most and then you can go and get a full size bottle of that i've already done two of them within like the past month and i ordered more on my you know order but um some are for gifts some are for me but you don't have to get this to get it you can always this is good for you like i i even use the little samples like yeah it's really good so the perfumes that I got, I just wanted to show you the perfumes that I picked up and the different sets that I got. I got the Vanilla Woods, Seven Virtues. This smells like a warm, a woodsy cupcake. Like, I don't know really how to explain it, but this was like all the hype, probably back in like 2019, maybe early 2020. No, not, not even 2019, but this was like really popular, but I just never got it. So like I said, I just really wasn't buying things like that, like beauty related. But um, yeah, so I got this and then I got Marc Jacobs Perfect, which, see, the set is $68. You get all these samples, like I said. And then this retails for $99. You get a full-size bottle for free. So this, not for free because you're buying the set, but this was $99. I bought the set for $68 and got this. So it, it's really like a win-win. It's a no-brainer. Like, that's definitely something you should get. I will always recommend you get those. Get multiple of them. Yeah. And I can't remember how much this retails for, but you can, everybody can look it up. Okay, so the next thing that I got were these Dennis Gross peels. Now, this, it came with more, but they're currently in my bathroom. They're being used. Well, this package hasn't been opened yet, so why, this is the one I'm showing you. But they came out with a gift set that came with this one in a 30-day supply of the regular strain for $154. And if you use these, you know that these are expensive on their own. So a 60-pack on their own costs $150. And the 30 set costs, I think, $88. So you're getting both of them for $154. It's like you're getting a whole month free. Um, these are amazing for your skin. I feel like anybody of any age should get these. I was breaking out really, really bad. That's another reason I started kind of getting back to beauty things. Because I started breaking out really bad. And I just didn't really... The stuff I had in the drugstore just wasn't cutting it. So I'm like, you know what? Let me get back into what I've been doing my whole life, pretty much. Stopping at Sephora. Getting my skincare from there. And, um, yeah, these are amazing. Like, I, I honestly hate that I love these because they're so expensive. And I feel like I'm rely, I rely on these a lot to keep my skin clear. But I have, like, acne marks all over my face. Like, they're, they're finally starting to come down and, like, not look as bad as they were. But I think this is definitely a factor of that. No, I know it is. I, I don't think it is. So I would definitely suggest that you pick up that value set. Like, I've never heard of anybody not liking these. Now, if you're not used to having like a kind of a strong skincare regimen, these might feel kind of intense on your face if you have, I guess, sensitive skin or whatever. But they do actually make a sensitive version of these. I've never tried it. I just tried the regular. I've actually never tried that strength, so I'm really excited to try this because I think if the regular does good, I can't imagine what these are going to do. So I would suggest you pick up the value set. Like I don't care if you don't haven't tried it before. I, I don't know. I guess pick up maybe the value set. And then pick up the sample size too. But while you can get that value set, pick it up. Because you can always take it back if you don't like the little ones. Just take back the sample size. The little pack, I think, comes with like five for like $17. So, 
get both and then if you don't like that but you're gonna like it then you can take it back okay so the next things are kind of things that i haven't picked up or really dabbled in at all but um i'm gonna share with you guys what i picked up or what i got so i got the let me look on here because i'm not really that good at so i would recommend that you definitely pick up fragrances now i know i said that you know the sephora bestseller said definitely get that but you know that doesn't have everything in it so if there's a fragrance that you really want or really been wanting to try, there's a few. That's why I'm like, maybe I should go back. But I've, I've, bought, I've gotten so many perfumes in the past two, three months. I really cannot bring myself, I don't know, <laughs> to get some more perfume. But I did pick up, besides the two value sets that I got in my um, Sephora order, I picked up the Mace, I don't know if it's Mason or Maison Margella, the replica perfumes. He has a set where they have the one ounces for $120 and it comes with two. I have sampled bubble bath from like a previous Sephora order. It smells so good. It smells like a clean, fresh, fresh out the shower type of uh, fragrance. I love it. And then it comes with By the Fireplace. I can't remember if I ever tried that, but I, I so we'll see. I'm, I'm blind buying it, but I just feel like this is a really good deal because the one ounces alone cost $72. So you get two of them for $120 on top of my 15% discount. I feel like that you can't beat that. So I'm gonna get those and I know I like one of them So and they're also um unisex. So if I don't like the other one, then I can just get it to my boyfriend He'll probably like it or whatever The next thing I got I don't know if this is like a weird video It's like a recommendation and what I got but I, I'm not doing a haul for this So I guess I'm gonna just show y'all what I got too so I also got um, a Brazilian Bum Bum Cream set. I've never had a full size of the Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. I love it, but whenever like I go on vacation, that's all I wear. I'll go to Sephora. It's like, you know, when you get your nails done, your hair done, your wax is done, when you go on a trip, right? A part of my thing is going to Sephora to get a mini Bum Bum Cream to take with me. So I always do that. But I'm like, you know what, I kind of want a full size and I can just refill my little mini when I go on a trip or whatever. So so I got a full size of that, but it, it's like a little set. The set comes with a full size. It comes with a fragrance mist, which I have tried that too. It comes with the body scrub, never tried that, and the shower gel. I think I have tried the shower gel. I actually forgot that I had tried the shower gel before. I thought I did, but now that I'm thinking back to it, I took that shower gel on a trip before too in a mini size. So... I got that. I was gonna do, I was gonna be like OD and get like the big E and the big shower gel. And I'm like, I mean, I like it, but I, I don't like it that much. And I have so much other like lotion and stuff. Like, let me not go crazy. Let me just get it the regular size of the big like, bubble cream with a few little extra. So I get that. I got that because I love that scent. And then, oh, pause. Back to the fragrance scent. I don't know if you guys can hear me talking about it, but it comes with, you know, they have like a soul fragrance in that set too so i'm gonna get that and that's gonna go so well with like the bazillion bone cream line i cannot wait i'm just gonna feel good the next thing i got was another sponge i mean this is like you are you already just fun this is so dirty don't judge me i can't let me show this right now but these sponges are so disgusting i probably had these maybe like a year now i like guess not for me to retire these and get another sponge i haven't gotten one sponges are like boring to buy but i'm like you know what let me just throw this in here so I really do like the Fenty Beauty sponge. I used to always get a beauty blender, but the Fenty Beauty sponge works just as good and it's four hours cheaper. So I always just get that now. Um, yeah. So now I'm gonna just, I guess, say some things that I kind of want, think, am thinking about still getting. But I also heard that Sephora's still gonna do a 20% off fragrance sale before the holidays, or not before the holidays, like before Christmas. So, I don't know how true that is, but I think that's another reason I'm, like, holding off on buying a lot of these fragrances. But, like I said, you know, the Piggy Bum Bum Cream, the Jumbo Size Shower Gel. Anything value size that you know you like. I don't know. I still might go back and get them. Anything value size that you know you like and is expensive, grab it. Grab it during the sale. Hair products. There's so many different, like, different hair product sets. The Olaplex set. I really want to try that. I, I'm thinking about maybe in that, but I don't really wash my hair that much myself. I usually go get it washed. Glow Recipe, I've heard so many good things about that. That's another skincare brand that I've just been hearing about and still haven't taken the plunge, but they have some good, they have a good value set out right now that I've heard some people talk about taking advantage of. Oh, and, and I see this when I stock and I bought it yesterday. I'm so happy I placed my order, so I was gonna stall and place it today. But another thing that I got was a Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray Set. It came with two. 
I usually get these slate, but this is such a good deal. I'm like, let me just get the all-nighter. The Urban Decay Double Team All-Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. I think these are full sizes, I'm sure, for $42. So that's a really good deal. Oh, I would say some Forever Mood Candles. That's something else I'm thinking, like, mm, I don't know, do I want to take the one? They don't really have that many on Sephora, and they don't really have that many, like, good ones. So I'm kind of like, I can just wait. She'll probably have a Black Friday sale, to be honest. Jackie, I know. I'm sure she'll have a Black Friday sale. That's probably going to be the time to buy them. But yeah, I would say fragrances, body care, and skincare. I don't really, I think even when I was like really deep into makeup, when the VIB sale came around, I would never really buy a lot of makeup. If you haven't taken advantage of the sale, I'll have the dates of it down below. I can't remember off the top of my head, but I know VIB ends on the 15th. I think the whole sale ends on the 15th. And I think Insider might have started today on the 11th. So yeah, I kind of want to get this video out before everything ended. And this is, you know, this is still like a holiday gift guide, VIB sale slash just overall recommendations. So these really are like some of my favorite products that I talked about. These aren't things that I don't think I'm trying anything out besides the perfume. Everything that I'm talking about, I love. So I, this is kind of like just an overall like the four product recommendations from me. I cannot remember what else did I get. Yeah, these really are like my favorite things. So that's really what I do. Like during the sale now, I just stock up on what I need and what I love and just enjoy it. So yeah, thank you for watching this video. I want to thank you guys so much for coming back to my channel and watching and supporting me. I really appreciate it. So if you could, if you, or if you do like this video, oh, I heard a bit of my cheek. If you do like this video, please like the video and comment down below and subscribe thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys again later bye